Yo, 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 and welcome to another build guide. This game, I'm actually testing a viewer requested build. I don't know who requested it anymore, guys. I have foggy memory, but somebody requested it. Um, the build is Eclipse Trinity Force. I think it was actually on our server. With that being said, join our server if you want to talk about builds. But let's talk about the rooms first. PTA, Triumph, Ability, Haste into Coop, really standard. Celerity, water walking because we don't have means to get on a target. You don't see a Yomus, you don't see anything in our build. So we just can't guarantee to get on target, so we can't guarantee to be in approach range. Then double AD into scaling health, normal max order Q into E into W. Smite Flash. Eclipse first. Why Eclipse first is a sheep item. It only costs you 2.8k gold. It gives you 70, 80, 15 haste and a fat shield and max HP damage. Self-explanatory, very, very bursty. Then we have Trinity Force, which is just the best item, in my opinion, for Udyr in general. But the little caveat here I'm going to say is that these, uh, this item pairs way better with Stride Breaker than it does with Trinity Force. You're going to see in the gameplay why. Gameplay was still really good. We just had like a little bit of a situation with one of our players, but it's fine. Then DD. I built DD a lot lately. DD is not a good item, but AD Udyr doesn't want to build a tank item. I just accept that now you like you building a lot of tank items just makes you drop off like a sack of potatoes basically so i go a like bruiser defensive options like dd sterox gauge more stuff like that then titanic hydra i would have built last if i had the chance because it's just like such a great item for ad would right you can just pop like two q auto attacks instantly with titanic hydra ldr for the pen and Swifties because you want to get into range, you need movement speed, they are still like really S tier for Udia in my opinion. Anyways, with that being said guys, let's get right into the gameplay. Alright, time for the Eclipse game. There has been rumors that there is a troll master here in solo queue right now. In the low diamond circles, but... What else we will see? Just want them to cover this. Eclipse Trinity Force. I'm gonna go this build here because they have a Yi and Eclipse is generally speaking good against him. He has Hail of Blades, so he's gonna win early games relatively hard. With his Q and his E and like Hail of Blades, he just wins early fights. So what am I gonna do? I'm just gonna avoid like really early fights that are not completely favorable to me. If we could get a ward on this, this would be absolutely baller. They don't like, really have a lot of champions that can do a lot. And quite honestly, I have no idea what this champion does, guys. If I int into her, she's no, I have no idea. I literally saw some of her abilities, but I have the memory of Joe Biden. Like, I already forgot everything. I know that her ult has a circle. And that you can't leave the circle. It's like Camille ult or something. Actually, I want to try if I can eat her out of this. Malphite is stuffing this. Golly. Oh, the gold. The gold, guys. My gold already. Surely this is not gonna change. I wonder if he's cheesing me. But he would have ignited if he cheesed me, I think. Just to make sure that I die. I'm just gonna trust my gut and say he isn't. He's probably here. Really? Maybe. Yeah, they have a point. This is not gonna die, I don't know what happened to him. We will see in a second. I mean, don't walk up if you think he's there. Okay, never mind. What skin is this project here? Guys, we need a project Udia skin. Be real, like we need a tech Udia skin. Be honest. Like the fact that every skin Udia has is either fantasy. Or whatever is kind of crazy. Like, it's fantasy or for fun, right? And that's kind of cringy. If a champion has, like, the same themes. Primal Fantasy, SGO Fantasy, Ink Shadow Fantasy, too. It's not a tech skin line. Um, Black Belt Fun, definitely not fun. Dragon Oraka Fantasy. So we literally just 
get the same two concepts either it's funny or it's fantasy look at cool shaman in different fantasy settings oh here he is a dragon shaman oh here he is an asian shaman whatever that means um i would say watch out for this i don't really have a gank on mid do i yeah. no i want to i want to go for this I want to at least hit this a couple of times for my passive, so when I gank, I have passive up, you know. He has to care. He's definitely gonna get pounded. Are they playing for TP? I'm gonna walk over. He's dead. Ooh! Ooh! That is... The Hail of Blades affect everybody. The Hail of Blades effect. He had so much attack speed for his first few auto attacks and then he didn't. Eclipse first. You know what? He with this setup in Eclipse would be crazy. Don't lie, bro. He with this setup in Eclipse would just one shot you. He is on his bot side right now. Just panic your team. Like you have to really like hammer this information into their skulls unfortunately because many people are just not gonna listen to free pings. See now I'm gonna ping again this. Because I now know he's pathing over to there. He might be on this but I would rather ping his path than anything else. He's probably gonna look for top side gank. I could actually try to contest the top side gank. Since he doesn't have flash. But I don't know what Aurora does, so it's a little bit awkward for me. Oh my god, he is slow. He does this. Interesting. He is behind in CS. I could go back here and pray for that, but I'm actually gonna stay. I think that he's gonna look bot side. Can I play this a little bit like worse, please? If I die here then I'm gonna punish myself after this video. Let me go back, bro. No, I'm I'm gonna go. You, you enjoy this, yes. You enjoy man. All yours. Hold up, I don't have the capacity to buy more. No, that was like straight. Like, I played this like an absolute golem with my auto attacks and my orb walking. Like, literally, I played this so bad, but it still worked. That's just timing. It's just timing, guys. That's all, all it is, man. It's just me being at the right. in the right position at the right time. Because I can read the enemy jungler. And that allows me. That allows me to play for shit. I do not know what this champion does, but I think I'm just gonna cook her here. Right? No? Well, that was her ult, I assume. <laughs> I have no idea. I can't walk in there because he is in there. I'm gonna walk in with attack move. He is. Uh, top is gonna get his ult soon, right? Kappa Chungus Deluxe. I was pro still level 5, I would have literally just suicided if <laughs> If Yon didn't walk it, this would have just been suicide. No, okay. Hey, how is he level 5? It's minute 7. He gets like the most solo XP. I can look for like a little punish here. I'm gonna get my passer from. Oh, he full cleared. Don't tell me. Mother. I have to go back because it's just cringe, you know? Like, 
take your back timers guys like i really don't have to stay here like me staying on the map walking back to my jungle is just a waste of time i can just back and get items and be three seconds late big whoop at this point in the game I would rather have the items like you gain so much you lose so little type in uh, kind of on afk farm here you know that urge to just AFK farm here. I know she's gonna ping me, but look. Yeah, I know, bro. I know, I know, I know. But do this. An AFK farmer, so. So sorry, Miss Jackson. I would kill bot right now, for sure. But it's one of these things where, like, do I need to? I don't. I can play Dragon here if I'm not an absolute. Little, little man. They're gonna die, they're gonna get triggered at this sort of this. I still say it's a W for me. Is he gonna walk here? No way, Jose, I have to send you to the back rooms. Man, can you, can you be decisive? Like, she walks it and she doesn't. It's going blade, it's quite expensive. You don't have all the top lane. He is a Narnia, he didn't even play Dragon. And I could like easily just walk top city, but I can kill Yi here. Matter of fact, I'm gonna keep my passive. He's not gonna walk up to this with the uh, lens. If he does, then Cheetah. That's what we talk about, boys. Like, this is how you would do, man. Now Malphite is wasting time too. I can just try this, honestly. Nah, I'm just gonna full clear. Like, I don't have to gank. He can't gank right now. He, do he flashed too, so... Also, you can see that's the power of having a cheap first item. Going Trinity Force first is just so sad. I wouldn't have killed there. Yeah, I'm squishy as hell right now, but so is everybody else. Quite literally. Even Malphite is squishy right now. Comparatively. And now I'm gonna get a clean little clear in here. Unless I wanna go mid lane, which I probably don't. I don't care. Good luck to you guys. See, this is like one of those where I don't even have to. I don't have to be there. The same thing would have happened if I'm there. I don't have the mobility right now to even catch up to this player. He does not have flash. If I see him on a play right now, I will counter. That's the idea. No. I'm gonna give Dragon if he really wants to. If he has balls, he just does drag because I'm gonna go back. Mm. No, nope, I guess. <laughs> I guess not. Don't want Tarbis here just to be annoying as hell, maybe. I don't care about him, I don't care about her. Yeah, the pizza wheel would be fucking annoying, but it's whatever. We could 4v4 bot, but like you have to consider, if I 4v4 bot, then I need my three other members to do their, their part. So I would rather just give the objective and play for his top side on repeat. Never like start hitting this before you walk up here because you can actually Q2 this. As you can see, now I'm gonna walk to his top side. He has no way to punish my bot side. I'm much stronger than him here. I'm gonna keep my stuff up actually. I could walk top side here, but I don't have to. Okay, Malphite is abandoning his jungler. He's not here. Like, again, this seems like a big deal, right? This seems like pretty bad. And I don't care. This is actually good. This is exactly how I want the game to go. Let him waste all his time on, like, gangs that don't even matter. That not go that are not gonna amount to anything while I'm just piss chilling. If I get this kill here, I'm gonna literally take the entire turn. I don't know her damage, by the way. <laughs> if I int here, you know why. No, I trolled already. I 
Goodbye. Goodbye. Of course I calculated all my HP there. You crazy? Of course I did. Master Chess is here. Can't do the plates, unfortunately. I grieved that. I'm not even gonna lie. I played it pretty, pretty poorly. So what did he get now? He got the bot lane gank where he went even and dragon. I got grubs, the second si top side and another full cleaner. I know we want to fight this pro, but I want to win, you feel me? I could contest this now actually since he is in the area. But I'm gonna play it slower. Because I want my crump. It's okay, I don't mind. He's so weak, it doesn't even matter. She got red buff. I'm gonna go fist Melfi here. That's fine. I take that trade actually. I'm gonna push this with the Asu here. I can tell you why. I'm not trying to take too much. I wanna walk into his blue side. Malphite is low. Yasuo is here for free. Keeping my passive. Ah, oh, why did he ward that though? That's so cringy. planning guys because I'm an asshole I'm also gonna take a scrum before I do herald and then I'm gonna full clear and then like you see how this is just like as soon as you do this once the chance of you doing this again taking his entire top side just becomes greater and greater and greater right like it just keeps on adding up basically because you're so strong and now you can take a risk yeah invade okay then after that you get kills a fight that you needed because you have items you want to use it just keeps on adding up udi is kind of unique in this regard though i don't really know if there's another champion that farms as well as udia where you could apply this i do play a lot of amumu but for a moment, I wouldn't like really look for a fight. I'm gonna go back and get my item. I wouldn't really look for a fight. I would probably more so just look for the CS and then a skirmish somewhere instead of like one v one But for Udi, like it just becomes more and more and more and more possible for you to do the more often you do this, right? Because he is just gonna get more behind. You're gonna get more ahead. Meaning that if there's a skirmish in his jungle, you just basically fist him there. I don't really care who that is. I'm not even gonna check the bush. I don't even have smite. It's about respect at this point. Dragon is spawning. I've misplayed it a bit. Ooh, but we're still gonna get the kill because he's just that weak right now. See, what I'm doing here is a bit trolly, because I can easily just walk up and send into the back rooms. <clears throat> I don't think this is warded, by the way. I'm just gonna force this. Yes, their bot lane is strong, but I do this so fast that I think I can just force it, you know. No smite. No smite either. I see Braum. I know that he's probably Crocs right now. No, oh, he's chickens already. It's becoming a bit iffy now. Maybe I can... Mm. You know what, let me just take this and leave. Becoming a bit iffy at this point, you know, like walking into his chickens next to everybody, that's a bit bit of an iffy one, if you ask me. Again, full AD is the truth. 
You just play like a scuffed bruiser assassin and that's it. There's just not much to it. We can just one shot here if we get a stun by the way. Leon is playing this way to safe, I'm not gonna know. Like look where she's standing. And eh, makes me not want to be here to be really honest with you. Makes me not want to be here. Is she chasing still? Oh you're dead, bitch. No, you left. She's tanky. She's actually tanky then. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, the fact that she didn't die there is actually making her quite tanky. I can just walk here. And then I can walk like this. Try to eclipse it. I do not know what just happened, but like I know what happened to them, but I have no idea what Aurora just did to me. Aurora, Aurora. Oh, can't pronounce that. Au Aurora makes me sound like a dog, man. Makes me sound like a freaking dog. I'm like putting lock screen, but. You know, usually you should probably tap, but I just kind of know just from them having like this HP and her getting like her uh, ult up that I can just like drop this and walk away because they probably have enough pressure here to do something. If not, they don't. Okay. I do not know why Leona is just griefing there. That is crazy. Like what? Like how do we not just help that Leona? That is quite crazy, you know? Like, what is our safe support doing here? Can I eat you out of this? I might be done for. Like, holy shit, bro. She backed, guys. It is fine, our Leona left. Winnable. Winnable. She backed. She wouldn't have killed there with our ADC. Promise. She got AD diff there. They're gonna get the Nash, it's not that big of a deal. Again, like I just, if I knew what Aurora would do, I would not even be there. But it's just 90% troll by our support, not walking up there for the ADC. Like, him being, like, if he died, they would have gotten 250, 300 gold or something, right? But that's not great. Okay, sure. But. First of all, they would have won this fight, but also her being alive right now did nothing. She just walked left and right in a bush, right? So it's just like kick W. We can play side lane here too. I'm actually gonna go LDR after this. Because the Malphite is very tanky and their Brom is getting very tanky too. Is so Leona taking a shit or what's going on? Dragon spawning soon. I think we have to play it for the side though. Maybe I can get a pick on side lane with Twisted Fate or something? I don't know. I don't know how else to play it because our Leona is probably trolling right now. Try to kill this guy. Like, this is our only chance. This is the only guy we can kill. And I can't do it alone. Give me a card, buddy. Where are we, guys? Like, this is so free. Man. You know what? I'm just gonna walk this. Perfect, perfect, help her! Why are you not helping her, man? Bro, I wanna scream. What is this Leona, guys? Hit something, please. Okay, we're probably not getting this because bot then is on it. Man, this fucking Leona, bro, it's actually kind of annoying now. Is this guy like... Playing on the toilet or what, man? Can I get LDR right now? No, not even close.
I don't know, this makes me just want to split, but my the thing is my ADC was actually strong until the owner just did all that shit, so I don't know. I kind of don't want to play side lane, but I feel a little bit forced right now. He is also not weak now, but it's okay, honestly. I don't really care that much. Like, he is going to be one shot the entire game for me. I should have went through jungle. What a MS boost. Perfect. Not bad. That's fine, we have six crops, we can win mid lane. Well, I'm a troll. Kek. Leona has ult, she doesn't have rush. I can probably play for something here. This is so fucking cringy, by the way. This is so cringy, and I'm dead too because I'm getting three men all set. This is so incredibly cringe. We didn't all do that. I'm just getting four men altered. <laughs> it's so cringe, bro. And we are not gonna do anything with that. We're probably even gonna die under the turret. Look at my full HP. Now she has Bormox. Let's just say she healed with Bormox and actually frontlined there. Aggressive lane, it says. I don't know about that one, fam. I need this. Okay, my team is just fucking insane, though. It does not matter. I don't like Aurora. She kind of... She's like one of these champions that is just annoying. Kill her, please. She's so annoying. She's so annoying. Kill her, please. Yes. Kill her. Jeffrey Dahmer episode. <laughs> Jeffrey Dahmer episode. At least not Jeffrey Epstein episode, guys. I think that's still an upgrade. Okay. I don't know. I mean, they have all sums. Do I trust them a little bit? I do. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I should have walked with them in retrospect. We can look for something here, I think. Just go, please. They have two people that... My Leona is standing outside of the bush. Now he's not even gonna walk here because he knows that we are here. Maybe I can catch him off guard in his own jungle. No, somehow he knows that I'm here. Ah. Cheap battle. No, I got grieved. I'm sorry, I need gold. I need gold for staying on the map here. I'm gonna walk like this just to see if they're walking up. We have visual on them. <clears throat> Is this possible, really? They're just gonna walk up and take it, I guess, for funsies. Yeah, we don't do anything here. My fucking Ude life is amazing, Leaf. Nah, I mean, it's just tough. It's just tough. I don't think I should have pinged for that. In retrospect, my team is just way too unorganized for that. Way too, way too unorganized. If they don't have the stupid attack speed slow champions, I could actually cook. You know what? I think I should side here. I don't think I can team fight with this Leona. Like, no hate. No hate or anything, but this guy is just playing so slow. That I just can't. I can't. I need to like do something else where I can have pressure without being forced to rely on the owner. AD Udi Gaming. Like I get cucked way too hard by the team comp if I don't have uh, strong support. Like way too hard man. He is also kind of strong now. I'm never gonna be alone if I fight somebody. This much is clear. We can probably just do this though. Just let her die. 
That's okay, we're not gonna get anything from that anyways. The fact that they still all walk together. Well, I can leave this, but it doesn't matter, we lost the game. We lost the game on this... Uh, I can run mid then and get the wave. Of course, Melford is here instantly, bro. Oh yeah, he has ult for me too. Great. <laughs> Whatever, guys, we tested the belt as well. I'm saying I'm not doing this again. I'm not doing this again. I'm so sorry. And I hate to flame a diamond player, but this Leona, like, Leona's not a hard champion, bro. Like, I, I hate to be that gay guy, but, like, Leona is not a hard champion, and you just completely solo lost this game. Like, she played so safe, bro. It is what it is, guys. We tested this build. I don't think we're gonna win it from here. I'm like dead for so long, I don't think my team can hold this. Look at Leona, waiting three seconds to engage there. <clears throat> I think if she synced the engage there with Kaiser auto-attacking, she would have actually done something. Oh well, guys, we tested it. You can't win all games. You can't win all games. Let's peep out the stats. I would say that the Eclipse Trinity Force is not that strong, by the way. I think you just have better combinations. Um, not a lot of damage, but we didn't get to auto attack a lot. A lot of mitigation, a lot of objective damage though. Like we actually did something on the map, we just didn't really get to play in mid game because of... I think Leona might be new to the champion or something. Anyways guys, if you like this video, give it a like, subscribing would be much appreciated. And join the Discord if you want to talk about birds. See you guys on the next one. Peace.